Merry Christmas, guys. I hope you guys are having a great Christmas. I know I am. It is the first of the morning here, so I'm the first one up, and I just want to fix my face by putting just a little bit of color on. And uh, it's kind of cold outside, so I just have on this sweater, and let me show you my little cute PJs. And these are the cute pajamas that I'm wearing. I have a little Christmas tree and um, I don't know who that is. I think that's that snowman and some snowflakes. So that's what I'm wearing today. Nothing fancy. We're not going anywhere. So I just want to pop on real quick to say Merry Christmas. And I will share with you guys a little bit later what I got for Christmas. And I'm getting ready to share with you right now what I fixed for our Christmas dinner. But of course today the boys are gonna go and go get some fried chicken because I didn't feel like, um, well, I'm gonna cook some meat tomorrow. That's gonna be probably some meatloaf. But they wanted some fried chicken for, you know, Christmas day. So I thought, okay, well you guys go ahead and have your fried chicken. And tomorrow, the next day, I will go ahead and make the, um, the uh, what did I just say? I'm tired. <laughs> uh, meatloaf. And that will be turkey meatloaf. But I hope you guys are having an awesome, a blessed day. I know it's not the same, you know, as having your whole entire family, you know, with you. We don't have anyone here but just the three of us. But you know what? I'm thankful for just the three of us. That's what we got to do. Just be thankful. Um, because, you know, I believe that Jesus is the reason for this season. I will always believe that. And that's what I believe. And that's what I know. So that we celebrate Jesus' birthday, even though we don't know when he was born. And I'm not saying he was born on today. No. But we just celebrate uh, Christmas time, at, you know, for his birthday. Because we know that he was born. So... That's the time we choose to celebrate it. Okay, I want to share with you guys what I fixed for Christmas dinner. First of all, we have some delicious, uh, what is this, greens with spinach mixed together. Got some delicious red beans because you know, guys, I don't eat meat. So this is <laughs> my protein. So I will be eating beans. Then we have some Spanish rice, which my family loves and stuff. It's so delicious. We've got some cornbread, got some potato salad. So that's gonna be good. And here's dessert. I fixed two sweet potato pies. I have one in the oven now. So here's the one I already fixed, looking good. And two cakes. This one was already sliced into because I gave a piece to someone. And this is a chocolate cake. Yum, yum. And last but not least, we have some red velvet cake. And these are going to be so good. So yummy. Ooh -wee. And you know I'm going to have to work off. Work out, I should say. Get all these calories off of me. Look at this tree here. I'm not gonna take it down to the first. I thought about taking it down before um, the first, like tomorrow, and my family was like, oh no, you can't do that. <laughs> we want you to keep it up. Okay, now this is my very last gift, and this is from my good friend, Edwina. Edwina, I'm gonna open this up and let you see how I look opening it up, okay? All right, let's go. This is such a beautiful box and you wrapped it so beautifully. The paper is so pretty and the ribbon, I love it. Okay, let's see what it is. It's so pretty that I don't even wanna um, mess it up. Gosh, I don't have any scissors with me so I'm gonna have to bust this bowl open like this. What could it be? I think I know what it is, but I'm not sure. Okay, we just gotta wrap, rip it up like a child. <laughs> well, maybe it's not what I think it is. I don't know. Ooh, a box. Pretty pink box. I don't 
think is what I think it is. And this is a beautiful box. I love it. What's in it? Tell me, Edwina, what's in it? I wonder if I should just tear this open because I don't want to, you know, it's got it nicely taped. So let me just be nice and unwrap it neat. Beautiful box, beautiful. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, this is so pretty. Tea set, cup, and this is so pretty, Edwina. Oh my gosh. You guys see it? This is so pretty, and it's nice and pink, just what I like. Oh my goodness. Rip this open. This is so pretty. Oh wow. You gotta be careful. Oh wow. This is ooh. Careful Liz. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Isn't that pretty? And it has gold around it. Can you guys see it real good? It has gold around it, it has flowers, uh, pink roses. This is so pretty. I love that. And some cups. These are so pretty too. Oh my goodness. Wow. Isn't that pretty? I can have a little tea party with this. This is so pretty. I love them. This is how it looks inside. And I forgot this has a top to it. That's how the top looks. All right. That on there like that and a couple of saucers ah. <laughs> I'm having difficulties don't break them pretty pretty and pretty oh wow this is so pretty 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 I believe that's it I want to make sure yeah that's it Oh, wow. Edwina, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for these beautiful uh, teacup sets and uh, uh, tea kettle. I forgot what this is called, but you put your tea in there. Thank you so much for this. This is so pretty. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I just want to share with you guys what I received for Christmas. A nice few little items here but I am blessed with a few items that I received first one here well this is the main one that I really love <laughs> I got a new phone yes I did I have a red iPhone 12 and uh, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen that this is by Apple so I am blessed to get that I am so happy I'm filming with it so I can't show it to you but this is how it looks it's red on the on the sides and red on the back the only thing about this phone um, they didn't have any good um, color choices they only had red black uh, white and I believe blue but the red the red does not look red it looks somewhat I don't know some like somewhat between this color and that color. It's a mixture of these two colors. It's not a true red. And I don't want to take it back and get another color, although I could, but they may not have, um, you know, the colors available because this is such a new phone and everybody's grabbing it. So you know how it is. It's just that it's hard to get the color you want. But anyway, I'll probably go ahead and keep the red because I can always change, uh, you know, use different um pop sockets you know on the back of the phone where I hold it so anyway I got that I got some money from my beloved mother I have it in this cute little box here she put it in that so I have that also I got this now I like this this is so cute wash your hands now yes indeed we all need to be doing that anyway especially during this pandemic so this is a sign that you put on the wall in your bathroom um, I'm not sure if it has a hook on the back, but it's tied to this cardboard. But I think this is so cute. Wash your hands. I love that. Then, as I showed you guys, 
the gift that I got from my beautiful friend Edwina here on YouTube. Uh, this is so pretty. I'm just loving this. I can't wait to have some tea or my coffee and set it on, you know, on top of the of the saucer like that. But these are so pretty, Edwina. So pretty. And I'm going to keep this box because it's pink and it's so beautiful. Then I got a pair of these ultra soft socks. Now, I love socks, you guys. I'm a sock lover. I love socks all throughout the year because I constantly wear them, you know, in the house. It doesn't really matter what color they are or the style, but nice soft uh, socks like this. Um, any style is what I like. Uh, this happens to be the short. I think this comes to your ankle. I like them coming to the ankle, the knee, the half. It doesn't matter. All sorts of socks. Fuzzy socks, Christmas socks, you know, it doesn't really matter. Then I got a couple of towels. This is just a plain white towel, a bath towel. Really cute. Just a plain white towel like that. So cute. And another uh, towel here. This is more like for a kitchen, looks like. But it's cute. It's pink and white. So that's adorable. And last but not least, this is what I wanted. I had asked specifically for this and I got me a Nutribullet so I can make me some smoothies. Yes! I have to figure out how to put it all together, but I know this is the part where you put all of your, you know, whatever you're going to mix it in. Uh, fruits, vegetables, you know, like spinach, if you want to put in there, all different types of fruit. You put it on top here. You're supposed to push it down. And here are the different uh, parts, you know, the top that goes to it. So when I get ready to make me a smoothie, I'll show you guys how it works. And that's it. That's what I got for Christmas. So I hope you guys like it. Real quick, I just wanted to show you how my Christmas tree looks at night with the lights on. And of course, all the gifts are gone except for these uh, couple of boxes that I have just for display and my two poinsettia flowers but that's it <laughs> i um when my son saw these he thought these were to open up he said oh you got me i said yeah i did didn't i he didn't understand why i wrapped them and put them under the tree and i told him it's for display for one and then so the tree will look you know nicer when i get ready to film my tour so that was the that was the deal so i accomplished what i wanted to do but that's how the tree looks at night, and I think it looks so pretty. Especially that angel wing with the gold and the sparkles. I don't have that many sparkly things on here, but you know, there's a few things. I think it looks pretty. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. So the sun is starting to go down here so you know what that means gotta turn on the christmas lights i got my tree on but anyway guys i just wanted to thank you so much for tuning in i just want to stop in and give a quick little uh merry christmas to everyone and i know you will see this the day after christmas or whenever i can upload it <laughs> i'll try to get it up to you guys um saturday which Hopefully you'll be watching it on Saturday, but if not, maybe you'll see it Sunday, okay? I love you guys. Thank you so much for tuning back in. Oh, I want to let you guys know that I will be on my little uh, Christmas break starting, um, I forgot when it starts. Starts the 29th, which I will be uploading my last video for this year on the 29th and that's a collaboration that i'm doing with the heavens pearl so make sure you check that out that will be at 7 p.m eastern standard time on september the uh september december the 29th excuse me and i'm gonna take a little bit of a break maybe maybe a couple of weeks until the uh january the 11th and then i will start back fresh for the new year okay so you guys if i don't talk to you after the 29th uh, i just want to wish you all a very happy new year very prosperous healthy blessed new year 
from my family to yours, we love you. And I thank you guys so much again for all of your love and support, all that you have shown me um, throughout this whole entire year. Watching my videos, commenting, liking, and, you know, giving me gifts. You know, when you send things of love, I really appreciate it because uh, you don't have to do it. But I, I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. So anyway, Happy New Year as well, because I know I won't see you. But anyway, and I may not take the whole two weeks off, but I'm just letting you know in advance, if you don't see me anytime real soon after December the 29th, then you know I'm just taking a little bit of break, okay? I'll see you guys soon. Mwah. Love you. Bye-bye.